to get in there now. What what piece of jewelry really stands out in your mind that she wore and do you like sort of have one of those moments that you remember where you were when you first saw her wearing it? Well, it's a lot it's a lot of the collars, you know, are always kind of fabulous. Um, yeah, I mean, you know, I don't know. It's like I'm here all the time, so I kind of always see them. It's I think I've seen them in bits and pieces, but I don't think I've seen the whole collection. So, and what do you think it is about Elizabeth? Was it the jewels, the fashion, the film career? What made her such an iconic, all-around legend? <laughs> she was the Lindsay Lohan. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Uh, I think it was just all of the drama, you know. But but still, she was still elegant. She still remained elegant. So there was a kind of a nice combination of that. She was a true movie star. So I think, sadly, those have all been replaced by reality stars, but, uh, you know, the dra drama along with the movie star kind of makes for intrigue, and I think that's why people were interested in her. And you're a fashion expert, you know, we've got the Oscars Sunday, but, it, like, when when actors and actresses get lent these jewels, what, what kind of pressure goes into that? Is it as much about the jewels as it is about the dress? Um, it depends on the dress. I mean, if the dress is super simple, then, yeah, you need fabulous jewels to kind of make it pop, but if the dress is really complicated, then... They're not doing too many jewels, so it's they're super important. I mean, and if you're wearing them in the wrong way, you could look like a fool. So they, they can definitely make or break an outfit, so they're hugely important. Have you ever been lent something that was so expensive that you had to return it the next day? Oh, you know what? I've been doing this for like 15 years. It's always, I've been on so many shoots where it's like, you know, I have $10 million worth of jewels and six guards. So it's, it's kind of sad that I'm just kind of indifferent to it now and you don't really realize you're just like oh my god I can buy like three houses with that you know what I mean it's just like oh this ring oh I could just if I just took this well I'd get arrested <laughs> as long as they didn't know <laughs> yeah. and then any fashion trends you're expecting to see on the carpet this Sunday? oh you know what I'm I, I think it's just gonna be really classic and elegant I mean especially coming from the nominees because I think I look at it kind of like a wedding so you know, they're just going to want to look beautiful. If they win, they're just going to want a classic, elegant photo. Maybe the presenters will wear some crazy fashions, but, well, I shouldn't say crazy. Fabulous. Crazy is good for me, so.